little bit of the Route Primer. Popping on a little Dior Forever Skin Correct, an all over complexion toner for me. I'm using this BK blending brush, the one that's got this nice slant to it. Milk Makeup in Blaze, the Wet n Wild bronzer in um, Call Me Maple, has a similar, very smooth formula. I've got a short forehead and short chin. Use the bronzer under the eye as a way to define. I tried to turn down the light so that maybe you could see some of the detail a little bit better. It is essentially contouring the eyes. This is an e.l.f. brush, the Rally, and I'm getting really high up on the cheekbones, a little bit on the forehead, a little bit on the chin, a little bit on the nose for continuity, and I also pop some on the kind of the upper portion of my eyelids and then the center of my mouth. A little bit of highlighter, so I'm still building up the dimension in my face. Get right up along the sides of the nose. A little bit here. Sure, why not? Let's give myself some angles, right? Here. And I just want to bring this forward. This little part of my face, I'm going to try to bring that forward. So I always use three shades in concealer. One is your skin tone. One is maybe four shades darker or five shades darker than your skin tone. And one is maybe two or three, maybe four even, shades lighter than your skin tone. I'm using a Charlotte Tilbury Brown. It's a very creamy formula and I went ahead and put a bunch on my upper lids here and a bunch here. And now with my BK207 brush, I have no affiliation, but I do like the brushes, so I'm talking about them. I just smear it along my eyes. And a little bit of fingers as well on the edges here. Add a little bit more pink to the center of the lip. Now I take my beloved NYX in, uh, the, and my favorite Jenny Patinkin Lash Curler. Here we go. Can I see what I'm doing? You certainly can't tell what I'm doing, so I don't really know what I'm showing you. Yeah, so I'm looking away now. I tell you what, I don't know, like all those young gals who got on YouTube ages ago and had their husbands and boyfriends basically build studios for them and telemonitors and all that, I get it. But those of us that are TikTok users, we want easy to use. You know, we want to be able to do makeup in the phone, see ourselves, load it up and go. We got spoiled on TikTok. And now that there's this talk of it going away, we're having to learn YouTube. You know, the community on YouTube is wonderful. From what I hear, it's a really lovely place to be. So I'm looking forward to that. I usually do my powders before my mascara, but I'm all kind of out of order. Mineralized skin finish. And yeah, I'm looking away because I'm trying to see how I look in the camera so I don't go, you know, ape shit with this product. Okay. It's all pinks and bronzes. So these are the two main colors. Little Milkies, pink and bronze. Ooh. I'll keep trying. <laughs> 